Brother, 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 brother. Things brother. are good today. Yeah, dude. Oh, let's go. <laughs> That's a nice fish. I think the action's heating up, man. <laughs> Set the hook. Oh my God. One, two on That's that boy. One. That's the one, dude. That's the freaking yeah, shot. Let's go. <laughs> Look at the belly on that fish. But man, is that gorgeous or what, man? <laughs> Come on. Good morning, Michael. <laughs> it's me, Egg Day too. Let's go catch some fish. Yeah, dude. Wait, my coffee's already in. I mean, there's nine and I'm cold. <laughs> One word to describe how this morning was going would be slow. The sunshine is poking through the trees and we decided to kind of cut the morning BS out of the way. Kowalski and I have gotten breakfast, coffee. We're all suited up, ready to go. So nothing left to do than hit the trail. Hey, the fish, what do you think? Ready? Let's do this. Nothing can quite compare to that morning hike in. You know what I mean. The anticipation of the day's events, it's like playing a massive game of tug of war in your mind where excitement and anxiety pull at each other and really get that imagination going. On our brief hike in, that morning glory had quickly turned into a warm sun and it was heating up the entire valley quite nicely. So first thing on the docket was to, of course, shed some layers, cool off a little bit. And I would say <laughs> the second thing we had to do was answer the most pressing question of the morning. Who's going first? All right, let's shoot for it. All right, bet. Yeah. Really get up around the bend. Nice. The excitement of the morning bite certainly seemed to slow down when we couldn't help but notice that there wasn't much action going on. So it was time to shift game plans a little bit, do a change up of the flies and maybe move a little further upstream. Oh! Fuck. That was a nice fish. Tell me how you feel right now. Bad. Big bad. Actually, I feel pretty good. Well, that's a nice oh fish. God. Joker! Yes, dude! That's a nice fish. Oh my god, it's so fat. We're looking at a bent out rainbow warrior on a chunky, chunky brown. That was touch and go. Cast it in there, hooked one. Just a heartbreak, just a, oh, one of those. Came off and you know, usually that's a telltale sign. Let's get back up there, move on up to another run. I don't know why, but I was like, fuck it, man. Screw it, let's just cast one more time. Bomb drawn up there and Chonker Chonkerson came out to play. I really, I think this might be a pre-spawn female. The dims on this thing are unbelievable. Let's, let's take a look at her. Look at the belly on that fish. That, I think she is actually just full of eggs. It is early September here in the high country and these fish are getting ready for the spawn. But man, is that gorgeous or what, man? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what do you think, let her back? Let's let her back. All right, man, let's and go. And she is off. Let's freaking go, baby. Skunk Woo. is off for the day. What up, 60? Hey, don't do that. You're spooking the fish. You're spooking the fish, man. What? Why walk in the water? She's just going to walk why? in the river. <laughs> Cows are so dumb. So, Mike, why are there so many cows here? Well, if you didn't know, the Forest Service and the ranchers will create a nice little contract and they'll let the 
cattle, open range, and a beautiful place like this. Oh, that's cool. Well, did you know that over 50% of Fly All Season viewers aren't subscribed? So if you like this content, hit that little button below. It helps us a lot. Thank you. That's it, that's it, then. let it drop. Oh, dude, that might be a rainbow. Good throw. Is it Cuddy? Yeah. Well, skunk is off. I finally, <laughs> finally got my first fish of the day. Oh, and the fly came right out. Yo, he's got some gnarly choppers on him. He does. That's a sick fish, man. So tell the folks at home what that fish is. That is a cut bow. Looks like a rainbow, but it's got the little red marks on the bottom side of his gills, which I can show you here. Yeah, let's get a look at that which with those little red marks, he is a cut bow because without him, he looks like a regular rainbow. Beautiful RPT. fish though. Yeah, that's gorgeous. That was man. a fun little fight he put up. Yeah. All right. All right, well, Skunk is off. You wanna see him back? Yeah, let's see him back. Hey, bro. I got some fishy nooks. Fishy. Skunk off nuts. fishy knocks, baby. Let's go. <laughs> this is another Rainbow Warrior style fly. Tungsten bead, a little bit smaller though, and a much sturdier hook. And that's what we got that last one on. Well, this little Debbie wanted to be on the Shamu cam. He came straight up and out of the water. That is so cool. Let's see him back. There you go. go. Little Debbie. You missed. <laughs> ah, what? What is that? That is an adjustable dry dropper, folks. And that's what we got him on. Too cheeky. Too cheeky. Chunk of grass is kind of giving me issues though. Yeah, that chunk of grass is going to be hard to get around. Yeah, like right there. It's pretty close. I'll do it. Nice. No, a little Debbie. What is that? Can't say I've ever caught a little brown trout that looks like that. He's got a goofy looking tail. He's got a frostbite tail. <laughs> but it's cool how the red spots still show. That's amazing. Well, thank you for eating my, my nymph there, buddy. We'll send him back. See ya. Now I gotta say, it is extremely satisfying when you can go into a run, catch a fish on your dry, roll up, and catch a fish on your drop. A little, uh, little bit beat up there, man. These fish are loving this Rainbow Warrior. We might have to switch up again. Now, of course, catching fish is the ultimate goal on a day like today, but sometimes, especially when the fishing's good, it can be just as fun to sit back and study the fish and just watch and see what they do. Well, we found something cool, so we're gonna go on a side quest to see what this little tributary runs to. We're going trout hunting. Very, very quiet. Uh oh. I like that. Come out, Come out. Get him out of there. You got heavy enough tippet. That's a great fish, dude. Get the footy. I'll get the net. Get him out the there he goes. Be careful, be careful. This is squirrely. Right, he's just wrapped around. 
Whoa. Yeah, dude, that's a chonker. Let's go. <laughs> yes. Oh, you casted it right before I hit play, man. I missed the hook set. Oh, that's okay. All right. Man, he smoked the <laughs> hopper too. Would you say Texas toast? Oh, this boy <laughs> is A1 Texas Roadhouse Texas toast. Nice close up of him. Great fish, buddy. Woo! That's a good fish. On the dry too. On the dry draw for that. <laughs> uh, he's he smoked the dry just right there along the grass. And you guys saw he actually went up under the grass, had to fight him up out of there. That was an epic fight. Uh, oh, that was fun. <laughs> That's why we came here. That's why we came, baby. Woo! Let's give us give us one more cheeky two on this boy before we let him off. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. That's a real good boy. Alright. Well, let's let him off. Yep. That's certified Woo. USDA fishy knocks right there, buddy. USDA. <laughs> Texas toast, baby. Yes. Let's go. Feels great, man. Dude. Let's go! That's a nice fish. <laughs> oh, that's a good shot right there. Boy. I think that's what you want. That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is called head hunting with hoppers. Well, and he's off. <laughs> that was an excellent fish, y'all. Whew! That is so money. So what we've noticed is that today it's been a little bit warmer and there's been a lot more bug activity both in you know actual bugs living in the creek and terrestrials late fall well late summer excuse me in the back country is terrestrial season and i think i think the action's heating up man <laughs> that was a donkey that was a big fish that was a donk donk that's some Texas toast right there. But don't could don't. Yeah, he did give it the Texas toast. That was awesome. Well, yeah, got, got to finish with the fishy nucks. Hell yeah. <laughs> Beans? Dude, 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 dude. We got to go get some film of that. They're coming up like crazy. Crossy, come on. Okay, so we've rolled to this run, and it is busting. There are fish going left, right, center. They're popping off. It's crazy. You don't see this much. Holy cow. This is, this is really exciting. This could be some big, hungry fish. He is active. He is active, active, active. He's on. I think that's a cutthroat. Oh, that's okay. I'm trying, I'm trying. Just stay with him. Oh my god! Yo! There we go, folks. That is too cheeky. Let's send him back. Give me some fishy knocks, boy. Boom! Boom! Him. Boom! <laughs> well, Mike, we got a lot of slippery boys. You want to activate Chomp Cam? I think, I think we're going to start a new segment here where I'm going to activate Chomp Cam. I'm calling my shot. I think there's Mondo's in here. Well, let's get it. Let's get it. I don't care if you've got the nicest rod, the best line, and you think you got a half decent double haul. Let me tell you this, folks. Casting headfirst into the wind, it absolutely sucks, and it can be quite frustrating at times. As a result, no chomp cam. Oh. 
Set the hook. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Kowalski, that's a chunk. That's a good fish. Don't let her go. Don't let her go. Don't let her go. Stay, 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 stay. Dude, that's a good fish. Yeah. Do you want me to net her? Yeah. Ready. And... Ah! Whew. Yo, that's a good dry that's fly fish. fish. Holy shit, dude. That was a fun fight. Hey, Kowalski, set the hook. I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> I was looking upstream because I thought it was a bad cast. Dude, that was epic. Oh, that was freaking epic. That's a good fish. Basket of butter. That's a good fish. That's a great fish, man. That's a good fish. That's some Texas toast right that's there. That's some Texas toast. Oh, let's go. Woo. You can probably grip his tail. He's big enough to grip his tail that's good. That's what I was trying to do. You want two on that's that boy? One. That's the one, dude. That's the freaking yeah, shot. Let's go. <laughs> that's a good fish. Holy cow. Doggy, that's a big fish. That's a good boy. All right, let's get him on pin. What do you say? Yeah. I got pliers on me if you need them. Oh no, this should come out real easy. Brother, 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 brother. Things brother. are good today. Yeah, dude. Uh, let's go. <laughs> oh boy, howdy, Kowalski. It looks like they made it to the end of the video. That's pretty nice. <laughs> thank you so much, and thank you for finding our content interesting. We're just a couple of goons having fun, putting some stuff together, and we're glad you like it. And if you're following along, really enjoying this whole, whatever this is. <laughs> the file season community. We got two things for you. First and foremost, being the Instagram, you know, fishy pics, we do giveaways, I'm always willing to talk, so hit me up, I, I love talking with y'all. And the second thing, pretty, I would say pretty big, is the Discord. If you want to become a part of the Fly All Season community and really get to know everyone else involved, please join the Discord. We got almost 300 people in there and we're talking flies, we're talking, you I mean, know, different fishing you spots. Name it all around the world. We have people from New Zealand, from Maine, Colorado, all the way to California. Europe, I think. I mean, it's- We got some Europe guys from it's France. It's so cool. <laughs> so yeah, hop in the Discord, join the community, and yeah, let's talk some fly fishing. You better hop in quick, because word on the street is, is fly all season's got some pretty neat stuff coming down the pipe. <laughs> and those Discord peeps, <laughs> they get- They're the OGs. They, they get the first notice, yeah. so. But with that, we got to keep running up this this canyon before the light dissipates. So, folks, whenever you make your way to the great state of Colorado or wherever you find yourself, make sure to keep those feet in the water. And until next time, tight lines. Tie lines. <sighs>